And I saw this before. It was just a little bit the last time it rained. And I thought, hmm, I wonder what that's all about. And now that it's been raining for quite a minute now, and there's an operated uh, skylight in the sunroom that's filthy as all hell. And then <clears throat> this light here, and I got to take the light thing down because there's all kind of bugs in it. And the fact that this up here, this is original to the house, whenever the original owners put this on, and the top thing melted, melted. But let's not make a note of that or anything because it melted because it gets really hot in here. But we have a leak. We have a leak in the skylight in the sunroom. And it's coming from that vent. It's right above the table. And there's a leak. And then, of course, all the crazy wall stuff and wall scratches and scuffs and dirty things and rusty things. And they're still writing on the door here, which is not a big deal. But then when you come over this way and you go down into here and nail pops and you just get into this corner and it's like, why? why is this all so dirty and nasty? Dirty and nasty, and then you come over this way. And I, and I wiped this down already, because it was really, I don't want my cats sucking in all this crazy stuff. And just, of course, we have more of this, this little crappy lighting stuff that's, you know, whatever. And then you get to this air conditioner unit, and it's filthy. I mean, filthy, filthy, nasty, really, really, really dirty. Really super, super dirty. And I think there's replacement vents for this thing, but it's really, I mean, inside here, really, really, really filthy. There you go. Good view. And there's a little problem with this. I, I've not used it. Oops. It's in the stop. It's in the off position. Stop. It's not on. Not on. And here's the main plug thing in here. And again, it's all dirty here. And don't, don't wipe off your dirty fingerprints or anything. Leave it all dirty. Don't don't wipe anything off because you know that would be too easy. And this thing turns on all by itself, and it's in the stop position. And I've used the the little buttons on here before. And yesterday it turned on. And I finally went in the basement because seller said that the heat wasn't working on here because she turned off the um, circuit breaker. It's a double circuit breaker, and if she had it turned off, this unit wouldn't have operated at all. She said she had the heat part of it turned off. There's not a separate switch in the uh, meter downstairs. There's not a separate switch in the circuit breaker box for heat or air conditioning. It's all attached to one. It's a double. And if it was turned off, it wouldn't have worked at all. But this thing comes on all by itself. All by itself. And now, I have a leak. I have a leaking sunroom because of this vent right here that operates with the switch over here on the wall for the ceiling. All I do is got to push it up or push it down. So if I push it up, I'm going to do it now. It goes up. But it's leaking. It's leaking and nobody checked it out. And this is a four season sunroom. And it's leaking along with all of the lovely don't touch any of that up or anything it might it might cause a <laughs> might cause the house to be like oh somebody is paying attention 
and then you come over here in this corner. Well, nothing's been, it's all coming out. All of this is not properly adhered to the wall. And then there's a, there's a nail out over here. So this plate here, and you can see how nasty it is underneath. It just moves. It just moves because it's not adhered properly. And then when I put this thing up top here, because I had my alarm thing, I had to move it to the inside. That whole strip up top there, it's only attached with one screw, so you can pull that whole thing out. It wasn't caulked in or anything like that. Just one screw on that end and one over there, and the whole middle is not attached. You can just pull it right out. <sighs> and I cleaned the dirty windows with all the dog slobber. I did it somewhat okay, but I haven't really been out here because shit like this just just pisses me off. And then there's this mark here, not a big deal, but it won't come out. Uh, it won't come out. It's on there pretty pretty permanently. And so, just one of many things. And of course, we have you know, every everything is everything is by uh, everything is just a whole bunch of. Nasty crap, dirty, filthy dirty. I mean, really filthy dirty. And this thing is all, it's just dirty. Filthy, filthy, filthy dirty. And there's a lot of windows in here. A lot. So the house. And that light thing needs to come down. But that thing up top, it, it melted. And there's a lot of nasty bugs and shit stuck into everything. But this leak here is what I'm worried about. And it's splashed onto this wicker chair because it's discolored and probably onto my new rug. But this leak here is a problem. And uh, there was no mention of the sunroom in my report at all. No, I have a leaking roof. Awesome. Not surprised. Not one bit. Right, Johnny? Right? Unbelievable.